and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and to everybody on YouTube for some Heimer Karma. That's right, we're gonna play a deck that we haven't played, I was checking, I think since like April. It's been a long time since we played Heimerdinger and Karma together. I wanted to try out different Nopify decks today. We did that already with the Leeson Z deck, um, playing some Nopify in there. And so we're going to try this in here too. I just you know wanted to play different Ionia decks because I realized that all week since the new sets come out, I haven't played any Ionia at all. So I need to change that. So we're going to just be playing old school control, Heimerdinger Karma as our two champions. Um, both of them have been changed. A lot of these cards in this deck, a lot of just Ionia cards in general have been nerfed at one point or another, but we're going to see how it fits in this new metagame. Um, you know, both of our champions are pretty powerful. If we can get them online, get to the late game, uh, yeah, could be pretty good. So we'll we'll just have to see. So let's play some Heimer Karma. And we're going to go take it on over to Ranked. Uh, with this, you know, new test for, for this deck. It's been a while. Because um, I think the last time we played this was before Deep Meditation was a card. Before Eye of the Dragon, Deep Meditation, that kind of stuff. Because these regions were playing Heimer Vi, right? Like at that time, you just played Vi instead of Karma. All right, they got Trundle. What do we got? I don't think we need to keep Karma in our opener. And this doesn't seem like a Static Shock matchup either. So we'll just keep the Eye of the Dragon and go from there. Thermogenic Beam. That could be good taking down a Trundle. Could be good. <clears throat> what if I just cast Claws of the Dragon to attack with Claws of the Dragon next turn? No, I'm not going to do that. We each hold a world within. We'll just do this. Because they want to end the round. Not all mean well. I think I just end the round as well here, if they're willing to end round. I got Catalyst. I can cast Deep Meditation, but the problem with casting Deep Meditation... I, mean, I might as well just play this thing if we're just going to waste the mana anyway. But the problem with playing Deep Meditation is that then I don't get to kill Trundle with Thermogenic Beam. And so I think I want to keep all of my spell mana... And so, yeah, I mean, if we're just going to pass turn, I mean, might as well just pass the 3 2. Alright, no Trundle. So I'll play Deep Meditation because it costs us one mana to play Deep Meditation. So we would have saved three mana, now we're going to save two. Hey, Kitty Dexterity, getting the cheers in here. Thank you, thank you. My cheers emo. There we go. And I could cast Mystic Shot, target them, and then I get a Draggling. Meh. I'll just save my two mana. And I'll just pass. Um. So here we can we can play a Heimerdinger with two mana backup, but that that just gives me Mystic Shot. If I wait a turn, we'll we'll have nine total mana, which you know nine is five plus four, so that's Heimerdinger plus deny. That sounds uh, like a better place to be. Okay, so we don't get the Heimer plus deny because we're going to get rid of the King of Trolls. Cheers out, Fox. Alright, still pass and turn. Okay, on over to us. Answers. I, have them. I do want to get, because of Ice Pillar, I do want to get another thing into play. But we got Concussive Palm. That Concussive Palm's a pretty good draw. That can protect a vulnerable Heimerdinger as well. Oh, 
Oh, the box is good. That's good, because they still can have vengeance. I guess force them to have that. Yeah, that worked out great for them, mana-wise, of having the box. Alright, we'll play our Static Shock and draw a card, look for our champions again. Look for a new Heimer, Dinger, or Karma. <laughs> sure. I would rather I would rather trade with the, that Troll Chan in their hand than kill the Spiderling. <laughs> that was just good for me. Like the Troll Chan's a better card. Maybe I should have notified that. So the on the onus is on us to do something because we would just run out of cards. Like you know, like we have ten cards in hand, so we can't pass because they pass, then we obliterate card in hand. I could play a spell and it comes into play for free, which was kind of my plan. but they didn't really give me any good targets for any of these spells. We are going to need to find our... All right, my... I'm going to kill this 3-2. Am I going to use Gotcha or Mystic Shot? I think Gotcha. We are going to, going to need to find our champions. We've only seen one champion so far. Probably just sitting over there with a whole bunch of removal. They're waiting for my champions. Imagination is not experience, and instinct is no substitute for planning. Yeah, uh, question is what how about a single Kar Karina in here for Karina because um, of how many spells we have? Honestly, what I'd be worried about there is I'd, I'd kind of be worried about milling out or uh, obliterating like our champions, especially obliterating Karma. I don't think that the payoff is worth it. Okay, so I only had nine cards at hand. I was thinking I had ten, so that's why I played that, but I guess I didn't need to because I, I only had nine. But, oh well. Had a whole bunch of nothing, also. Good old control mirror. So if I play, if I play Mystic Shot, then we get a Draggling. But it's like a draggling on their attack turn, but it would also make my deep meditation cost less. Nopify. Alright, we finally cast a Nopify. That's the first one. There we go. We stopped them from killing my Eye of the Dragon and stopped them from getting a Nightfall card. Oh yeah, we got Flash of Brilliance. That card's pretty good. Draw a champion. Breathe in, breathe out. There's a champion. Imminently logical. (sighs) 
They have this again with the box. Singular will. Um, I'll keep the Mystic Shot in hand. We could we could Mystic Shot them and get another two one. Well, maybe we do that. We're gonna run out of space for cards anyway. We still have deny for ruination. Kept that in hand. Alright, they're down to five. Alright, good job, Heimerdinger. Did your job. So that's their... That's, that is their third avalanche. Yeah, that's their third avalanche. They've played two of the box. They've played three avalanche. I'll, I'll just pass, though. Because I could see them getting, like, a 1-1 with, like, a Vile Feast. Ah, Withering Whale. I fight with my spirit, not my fist. Thermogenic beam this thing. Oh, they're back up to eight? Hmm. Because I want to get the Draggling, right? So I want to play another spell to get Draggling. But I don't want to play any of these. I guess... I guess gotcha. So I think we're still... I think we're still... Okay. As far as waiting... Or, like, as far as playing a longer game. You know, we have to be worried about, like, harrowing with Trundle, but they've only had one Trundle so far. Yay, Karma! Alright, so I am not going to play this Karma, because it can die. I am going to wait until we have a second Karma, so that whenever I play this Karma... Then we play our second car. Then we'll have the inside of ages for our second karma. There we go. Not all mean well. Then inside of ages, we'll shuffle two karmas back into my deck. And gives four spells, of course. We'll bring peace to Ionia, whatever the cost. That works. Put Karma back in my hand. Where are we out? Oh man, we're gonna have the pursuit of perfection. Let's go. Please not karma. Okay, cool. We can burn that. Just get that out of my hand. Living Shadow gets to 19. Yeah, we, we put leveled up karma in play. We could have double pursuit of perfection. That would be pretty good. Can't, I can't empty cards out of my hand fast enough. So is our opponent only drawn just the one trundle? I guess. They've drawn no rekindlers or anything? Because, like, so, like, their... I wonder what their deck's supposed to be doing. Like, their deck is going to be, like, trundle, rekindler, or harrowing. Right? And they've only played one trundle... Oh, and Ledros. Ledros is probably a thing, too. Hmm. 
I wish we could play Pursuit of Perfection also this turn to go along with Karma. Which I guess, you know, we, we could. I guess we could. We're gonna go this route. I think they have another... <clears throat> I think they have another of the box. They're, they're playing three the box. That is so many at the box. Let's see if we can get any good protection for karma. Because I want to do the plus three, plus zero, and attack for lethal. May just do double pursuit of perfection, but then they definitely uh, ruination that away. They gotta be sitting on another ruination. Hey, what's up? Come on, pup. Come here. Come here. Little girl. They gotta have another ruination, right? I think it's still just pursuit time. Nah, we're gonna pursuit on their turn. We just won't be able to double pursuit. We must make our own path. We will not stand by. Yeah, so I'm probably gonna go Ritual Renewal. Like, they go Ledros. Because they're trying to go Ledros Atrocity. So now I gain 14 and go back up to 18. Oh no, burn to Karma. That is bad. Alright, we can burn deep meditation. We can't cast that thing anyway. What? Just a 10-10? That's not too bad. So they probably think their 10-10's pretty big, right? That's what they're probably thinking. Puppy, let's show them what, what's really big. <laughs> let's show them what's up. Think your 10-10's big? Double catastrophe. <laughs> Alright, we'll put their 10 10 back in their hand. Double catastrophe. Got that. That is not something you, you see very often, that's for sure. GG's. As it was meant to be. As it was meant to be. And All Freljord? Mono Freljord. Don't need Nopify against Freljord. Um, yeah, none of these cards look very good. Static Shock can kill, like, Omen Hawk and Avarosen. Sentry, I guess, Ice Veil Archer. Maybe I should have kept Ice... Maybe I should have kept Static Shock. <laughs> you just want to sit like this? Alright, that thing looks kind of scary and annoying to deal with. We're just going to get rid of it right now. Good thing they didn't just play Elixir of Iron. Oh, that was worth it. Oh man, I love that card. Jealous. Man, that's some, some good stuff they just had there. Hmm. Is that pass? If they want to pass too, that's cool with me. We want to go to next turn. United, nothing can stop us. Uh, so it looks like they got pretty lucky. They hit the allegiance ability. Got pretty lucky there. No. 
The good part about Mystic Shotting is we get the, the two on Draggling. But the problem with Mystic Shotting is then I don't get to go Heimer and all this stuff. I'm going to go ahead and do it, get the Draggling, and then basically kind of assume that they're going to play like this huge plus three, plus three Overwhelm thing. And then I put it back in their hands. Man, that thing's still just a, That's not a great card to put back in their hands. Um... Alright, so we're blocking. I guess we're just gonna do this. We'll block that with the draggling. Okay. That is not the right card to put back in their hand. Eminently logical. We go where the war mother beats! Man, they hit the allegiance trigger again? They're so lucky. Two for two. With allegiance. I'm gonna be making the attacks. This is our homeland. And try to do four damage to this thing. I'm reading her still awesome. Uh, 10 10 overwhelm. Well, I don't like to recall those things and let them re Averose and Hearthguard, but I just don't think we can deal with 10 10 overwhelm. So let's turn it back into a 5 5. Muffy's <laughs> just like resting her head against the desk. Nopeify. So we could go Dragon's Rage. I guess I get. I guess with Dragon's Rage they can just uh, Frostbite, and that's not as good. I'd rather try this out first. But yeah, that is that is nice. They don't have Cooling Strike. If it's a fight, See, good thing I didn't Dragon's Rage. Nope, like all their spells are burst speed. I don't I don't think they have a single card that Nopify can even hit. The War Mother will unite us all. Just gonna play the deep meditation. Alright, good call. Should have probably done this first. Malevolence. Another Heimer. And we have it. You own what you take. Alright, so that thing's an 8 9. So I cannot save the Heimerdinger. But we can replay a new Heimerdinger. I guess we don't really have to right now, though. We can just kill this thing. We'll get another Draggling the next turn now. Go right to attacks. They're at eight. Stand and defend. Sometimes Heimer's gonna Heimer. GG's. All right, we're two and zero. Oh. Twisted Swain.
We're gonna mulligan them all. See what else we get. We could definitely get ran over. We're hoping that they have a bunch of removal and have a real slow hand with a bunch of removal. But then again, they have those eight mana cards and those are gonna be difficult to deal with. So this is gonna just be a difficult game. I like seeing that. If they would have gone right to attacks first, I was certainly considering playing Health Potion and healing back to 20 and then playing that for 2. And so therefore then my Deep Meditation would cost 3 the next turn. And be able to play that. Definitely thinking about that. Yeah, you can play Karma with Lux or Ezreal also. Absolutely. a fair game or played one soak it in all right so they're definitely going to kill Heimerdinger Answers. we gotta just hope that we find a, a new Heimerdinger like it's obvious it's obviously going to die or we're just going to get like some three ones. I don't think I could just pass, but I don't know. Maybe I could just pass. Progress waits for no one. You pay. I talk to spirits. These are my rules. Next text transmogulator. Yes, yes, again. Fortune Croker is pretty awesome. Good upgrade for the Twisted Swain deck. I'm glad. I'm glad they printed a good upgrade for that deck and needed it. It was kind of hurting. Glad no make it rain. Very glad no make it rain. Yeah, it's true. So our, our true shot barrage could work out pretty well. Now this turn we now kind of have deep meditation unlocked. If you were, I'm gonna just make these blocks. There's not too much difference between two or three damage. I guess whenever we're talking about trying to get to the bigger things, there is. And considering one make it rain would kill both of these turrets, I will just trade my two turrets for these two instead. They haven't shown that they have make it rain. Right, I'll take that trade. As the serpentine. For silver I talk, for gold I taste it. Okay, so now we can static shock to kill Twisted Faints. I don't have twin disciplines to protect karma. The dragon could be good. We would have the twin disciplines to protect I the dragon. Yeah, you can refresh too, Michael, if that usually resets the stream also. So they're passing over to me. I have 10 cards in hand, so it's probably why they're passing over to me. So I could take the pass, and then my top card gets burned. 
but they also I I kind of get back even on mana, right? Because I'm so far behind on mana. They would assume I would kind of assume that they would go right to attacks to be able to play a Riptide Rex. And so if I'd want to stop them from dealing the damage for that, I'd have to spend my four mana on a gotcha here. Kind of like trading my top card for resetting this mana disparity. So I hope they go Leviathan. All right, cause like they go Leviathan, I go Will of Ionia on it. I fight with my spirits, not my fists. Destination in sight. That gives them one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this will be their tenth card. So now they they will burn a card now. And that's two spells for me. What is for Dragoling. Ah, I was hoping for Riptide Rex. So I can transform my Eye of the Dragon into a Leviathan if they want to play another Leviathan. Which, nope, does not look like they do. This is risky. So I, basically I have, you know, like just one deny or I have twin disciplines health potion. So like if, if their plan is like do a little bit of damage to karma. Oh no, I can't. Uh, I'm gonna say they're gonna do a little bit and then ravenous flock. Guess we have to do this to keep ravenous flock at bay. Please don't have a little bit of damage in Ravenous Lock. Yes, they do not. Okay, good. Peace begins within. That was very important. They definitely have Ravenous Flocks because you know, they just have like the other Swain or anything. By force of will. This is me taking three. I don't think I'm supposed to take any damage at all because of Riptide Rex. So it's basically, am I casting, am I blocking or am I casting gotcha? Your lesson begins. Those are my two options. If I cast gotcha, I have six mana left. I guess I could just block like this and then gotcha over here. Yeah, actually I like that. I like that. I don't want to kill my Eye of the Dragon. That still gives them Riptide Rex. They just drew that. Oh, that levels this up? Oh no. I know, that's where we need our Nopify. Our Nopify would have been perfect there, right? Yeah, where's our Nopify? Breathe in, breathe out. Oh no. We each hold the world within. There'll be blood in the water. Can't save Karma. That, that just worked out terribly for me. If they, if three of the seven, if three targeted Karma, we could save Karma. Riptide Rex is just too good. <laughs> yeah, Riptide Rex is, is Riptide Rex the best champion in the game? Maybe. We'll bring peace to Ionia, whatever the cost. Wow, 
Finally, Nopify shows up. I guess I could have... I guess I should have done the Nopify... Or no, because Nopify can't stop skills. The thing is, is, we know they have a bunch of Ravenous Flocks. So it's like I could I could try with Nopify to stop Ravenous Flock, but we know they have a bunch of them. So it's just, it's just not going to work. I guess I Nopify. I will break them. Sacrifices must be made. Okay, so now I can static shock these two. Gotcha, another. Two go to seven. My legacy. Deploy. Dark in the skies. That level up Swain play, Swain hit me, kill my eye of the dragon. Cost me this game. Also, Crypt Rex is not an acceptable card to have available in a format. Lee Sin Zed with Targon. So they're playing the inferior version of Lee Sin Zed. Freljord's definitely better. I'm keeping the first three cards. Twin Disciplines is the only one that I am not sure about. I don't know. I don't know if... I'm going to just say replace, I guess. If I'm not sure. All right, we got a lot of cards for for uh, Zed, so hoping that they get more Zeds. Don't have as many cards for Lee Sins. I guess the first one has to go towards the goat. So they don't get free gems. Not where I wanted to use that. Stop. Uh, yeah, we played it earlier, Michael. Mystical levitation requires concentration. Is there anything in their deck that we can nopify? Not sure if there is. Breathe in, breathe out. It is time. Beware the dragons. Yeah, they're gonna wait till they have Bastion available. Overwhelm card. There you go. Yeah, that's a great card to overwhelm. Conflict is all in the mind. I fight with my spirits, not my fists. Our enemies would be foolish to underestimate you. My lands need prepare yourself. Unfortunately, that plus one, plus one from, from Bastion is going to leave this thing at one. I need one more mana. It's 
do a plus one plus one. Right? Or no, never mind, never mind. Cause that just eats never mind. No, that we don't actually do the four damage. Never mind. <laughs> Forget anything I just said. What is gained when we return malevolence? I fight with my spirit, not my feet. Okay, but we did eat a bastion. They can only play three bastions. It's not super likely they have more bastions. I am the blade in the darkness. Hmm. They're gonna go with the overwhelm card. I can't stop that, but hopefully no deny, no no bastion. Yay! All right, so that's important. I get Zenith Blade underneath my Nopify. Darn. Hey, uh... Popped a dim. Pobed. Still working on that. How to pronounce your name, but hey, Pobed. Only the worthy survive. Took a little bit of a hit. The spirit gives to those who listen. But their plan is just, yeah, replaying that. If they have, like, the other Zenith Blade in hand. Yeah, I was gonna say, I could definitely see them just having the other Zenith Blade in hand. Yes. That was the card I wanted. Thank you. That was the card I wanted. Wow, nothing. Just let it happen. I taste purple. Yay. Wow. I don't like basically I kinda wanna be able to counter that I wanna be able to counter the uh card that gives the overwhelm. I don't know, so I wanted to keep Nopify up. We already played two spells, so we're gonna be getting the Dragling. That's a problem. I suppose I could have played around that card. We each hold a world within. So that's their last eye of the dragon. Uh I'm not sure, Breeze. You'd think if their plan was to cast that deep meditation, they would have just simply cast that deep meditation before they had all their things die, like in case they would have found a protection spell or something. Oh yeah, we get to Nopify. We can Nopify their Nopify. All right, looking for our champion still. We haven't seen any of the champions yet, right? Halfway through our deck. Yes, champion. Let's go. Peace begins within. The exact, you know, last card for halfway through the deck. So now we get double flash of brilliance. We get two random cards. Okay, that's. That's fine, I suppose. Within my grasp. Put him down to nine. No, we don't need to do that. Not really much difference between being at nine and being at three. It's just one strike with the twin disciplines. But if we find a like, Heimerdinger. All right, so doing this, like, if we draw Deep Meditation, now Deep Meditation will cost three mana. If we draw that the next turn, 
I think that's just okay to, to get out of hand. Okay, or we free up another spot with Inside of Ages. Alright, so I have Nopify protection. So I have Nopify and Deny protection. Could have also gone stand united there and just switched the spots, but only oh, did I. And GG's, we are three and one. Ran them out of threats. Killed their Lee Sin, killed a couple Zeds, killed a whole bunch of the, you know, a whole bunch of like the three twos that, a whole bunch of the mountain goats, and also all three of their Eye of the Dragons. And there we go. My favorite deck to play against right now. I'd say probably Scouts. That's probably my favorite deck to play against. Alright, let's keep let's keep the rest of these. Nopavai can stop a lot of things here. Noxion Fervor, make it rain. All sorts of stuff. We're definitely going to want to cast two spells in a turn fairly quickly. Get these Claw of the Dragons and play for free. That'll help us do it. The spirit gives to those who listen. Coming in hot! Man, so it Feels like I need to save Flash of Brilliance. For him. Behind you. Ready yourself. Damn it. But I think we have to play it. Nopeify. Your head. Let your instincts speak. I'm gonna kill this thing right now while we already took damage this turn. There we go. GG's. Wow. Got nopeified and was like, nope, I am out of here. <laughs> that is awesome. Alright, so another 4 1. Man, great records today so far. That was that was a game right there. <laughs> so they just saw all those claws of the dragon coming into play because so basically i was clearing out their blocker we already took a damage that that turn so we don't have to worry about the gangplank level up and then you know we were going to get the draggling so we're going to be able to just like swing for nine uh in the open open field there and uh yeah that was going to be awesome <laughs> Um, so yeah, there we go. There's Heimer Karma. I think it, I think it worked out pretty well. We played against like some control mirrors where there's a lot of turn passing. Um, I don't know. Nopify kind of did its thing. It was, it was just fine. And yeah, I think, I think we could still play some Heimerdinger with Ionia. You know, Heimerdinger was great. Karma was great. Um, these little things were great too. These little dragon cards. Awesome. All right, those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. Leave those comments. Let me know what you think of this deck, um, any of the, the earlier decks, or uh, just what do you want to see on stream? What have you been playing? You got any deck ideas for me? Feel free to send them my way. But thank you so much for watching. Some Heimer Karma, and I'll see you for the next video.